I've been playing around with the alpha version of Drupal CMS version two, which has Drupal Canvas in it. And I really wanted to play with the Canvas AI. And I do recommend that you read the documentation on it if you want to set it up because the module is hidden by default. So you need to install it using Drush and also set up your API keys and Drupal AI. But let me just quickly show you how it works because once you have it installed, you do have this nice little AI icon, which is kind of like the standard now icon for AI functionality. And let me just prompt in a few components and let's see how it goes. Using the page builder tool, place a hero component in the header region with the title, latest Drupal changes. Let's see how this goes. Apparently you need to be very specific with the wording for the certain agents to get picked up. And that's all in the documentation. And that just automatically updated. There we go. There we go. There we go. Awesome. All right. Now I do know that we have a pricing component. All right. Let me try that. Let me try that. All right using the page builder tool, place two pricing components in the grid region with the first price being $10 and the second price being $20. Okay, I don't know if that was good. <laughs> I don't know, let's see, let's see what happens. Using the pricing, okay, let's see. So it should, place it below because I've added a section component, which seems to be the thing to do. Now, this is the first time where I'm playing around with Canvas. Look at that. And that just automatically generated it. That just automatically generated it. Perfect. Using the page builder, place a call to action in the footer region with the title of click here, and contact us. Let me just put in CTA. So you should then add it below the pricing. Let's see if it happens. It's thinking. Okay, apparently it added it in, in the footer region, but I can't see it. I've added it in the footer region. Oh, okay, that's my fault. User error. I did say footer region, just didn't know it was that footer region in the section region. Anyway. Look, this is still early days, but it is pretty cool what you can do with Canvas AI. Now, one thing that is mentioned in the documentation is that a lot of tokens are used to generate these pages because you can imagine that it's, it's essentially generating code and then chucking it in. And here I can see, here's my dashboard for just today. I've created a bunch of pages today and I've already used over half a million tokens. And if I go to the login, where is it? AI logging. And you can actually see all that's returned. So that's pretty much everything that is returned. So there's a lot of tokens. So just be aware of that. It is going to use up a lot of tokens. Now, it is pretty cool being able to create landing pages with a few prompts, but you do need to be very specific with those prompts, but I'm sure things will be much better in the future.